Good morning, folks. Nice little break in space weather activity here for a couple days. We did see an M-class solar flare this morning, but it was at the limb. Solar wind at Earth has entered calm ambient stream state, and even the erupting plasma filaments are taking a bit of a break compared to last week. As we watch that solar flare this morning at the incoming limb, this area will obviously be a watch in the days ahead as it turns in, but also a new sunspot group being born as we speak growing at low latitudes there and could produce flares by tonight. Folks, NASA dropped about 40 new animations through SVS last night, and all of them detailing their best guess as to what various black hole binaries look like. Folks, none of this escapes the true trouble with black hole science. Dr. Pierre-Marie Robitaille and Stephen Crothers have demonstrated how much of that science needs updating. But alas, an interesting aspect of their guesses is that most are not so much guessed based on spotting the binary couple or witnessing orbital oscillations, but by the flaring period. How often do we get bursts of X-rays, for example, from the system? Yes, folks, it works at all the stars when you dump material in, and it works for what they call black holes when they accumulate material as well. Heck, it works when water gets down through the cracks of the crust to hot rock and steam erupts upward in an active volcano. And yes, it is actually a great explanation for short period recurrent nova. I actually like this idea about triples for the short recurrent stars, probably not for all of them, but remember, for stars with longer recurrences, anything from a binary to encountering a molecular dust cloud in space to the galactic current sheet can work, but for those that boom every couple of years, I do agree a binary is the best way to dump that material onto the star. By the way, this video from April 29th is making quite the noise. You remember those professors and NASA and ESA engineers who help out quietly behind the scenes? It would seem they are getting bolder in their sharing of this new revelation with their colleagues. I know, because I'm blind CC'd on many of those emails. We greatly appreciate your support. We've got tons of resources for you in the box below the video. We've got wind maps and shots of our star to close. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow right here but right now it's 5 30 a.m in the new valley of the sun eyes open no fear be safe everyone